Hello, welcome back to Robometrics. In this video, we talk about how to move a turtle board around. We do so it in a way so that you can implement it in any other robot. So to begin with it, you first need the turtle board simulator. If you don't want to git clone this, you can simply use the method which I've shown in an earlier video. I'm linking it down below. But I like to do this so that my whole pack, whole project is encapsulated in one package. So I'll do a git clone here inside SRC. So I'll do CD SRC and I'll do git clone. And yes, so we have TurtleBot simulator. What it gives us is TurtleBot inside a gazebo environment. So to launch it, we'll do ROS launch turtle bot underscore gazebo and turtle bot world dot launch let it open so yeah this is the environment which I've shown in the earlier videos as well uh, I'll move the turtle bot to a safer place so that when we give it commands to move it has a free space to move okay so before we go on the next step, let's do a ROS topic go to understand what all topics are being published right now. Remember, I have already sourced my terminal. Don't forget to source your terminal. So I'll do ROS topic echo, ROS topic list, sorry. I want a ROS topic list. Yes, so I have this many topics these are the total topics and this many topics for velocities. So in this particular version of TurtleBot and Gazebo, I don't get CMD well, which might be a case for many of you. If you have CMD well, that is what you'll be publishing to. That is what your topic will be for TurtleBot. But if you don't, then the topic which we'll use is CMD well mux slash input slash navi. This is what we'll be publishing to. So let's see what basically the type of messages it uses. So to check out the type of messages it uses, we'll do ROS topic echo CMD well marks input and navi. Oh, sorry, let's do ROS topic info. Echo will actually show you what is being published since it's not being published right now it's not moving but if you want to see what the type of message it is we need info okay so you have geometry message twist correct so geometry message is the type of the message and twist is the method let's see on on google yeah so you have by ros.org geometry message type and it has this many other messages inside it. We need twist. So if we go inside twist, we have three, two things, linear and angular, and both of them in, encapsulate x, y, z. Basically x, y, z is the velocity in x, y, and z direction that is the linear and similarly the angular. Okay, um, yeah. So the next part would be to write the Python script. I'm storing the Python script here inside my turtlebot underscore tutorials package which I've created for this particular video. Inside that package we have a scripts folder and inside scripts I have move underscore turtlebot.py. I've already made the permission. Let's see its permission. So I've already made, made it allow executing file this file as program. You can do this again by using the ch mode command. I've shown it in, in an earlier video. So let's see what is inside the Python file. So first I need to import this, the twist method from geometry underscore messages dot message. And I'm using the node as topic publisher. You can use any particular node is what you are defining. Now the next thing is which exact topic which you are using. We are using the CMD well mux input navi. If you have CMD well which is being listed in your ROS topic list, 
then you can go ahead and list this. Twist is again the method which we'll be using or the message type which we say and queue size is one. Exactly what this means is what I've shown in an earlier video. I'm linking it again down below. So I'm calling the move method. So I'll say I'm defining the way we can allocate the values and the way we will allocate is allocating the values in x direction so yeah move dot linear dot x exactly like that why is it like this is so inside twist that is what our move is we are going dot linear and inside linear we have dot x okay and the same way it's for angular angular and z that is what our next is allocating values in the z direction this is angular and this is linear okay and this is basically how our publisher runs while ross pi dot shutdown is not and you give array dot sleep and you publish the move thing which is basically your publisher the method basically and pub is uh, the publisher and move is what exactly you are publishing inside that publisher um, so let me do one thing now we'll again run this python file to run the python file we have ros run turtle bot underscore tutorials is my package name correct and i have um, name of the file is move turtle bot underscore dot py before i do this let me open up gazebo and show you let me hit enter and we see the turtle bot is going forward and also turning at the same time that is what our basically file does when we do it in this particular way it basically goes in a circular motion switch it off yeah so it's still running because i've not switched it off and yeah this was all uh, to move the turtle bot around to See the next video we'll be working on how to take the laser scan reader readings and work on it to move a robot around. I hope this was helpful. Stay tuned. Please do subscribe Robometrics.